Hey everyone, welcome back to AI Motion Studio. If you've ever wanted to edit complex images as effortlessly as waving a brush, then Magic Quill is the tool for you. In today's tutorial, we'll explore how to install Magic Quill in your comfy UI and make the most of its powerful editing features without any limitations. Magic Quill is an intelligent, AI-driven image editing system that puts creative control directly in your hands. Whether you're an experienced Comfy UI user or just getting started, this tutorial will help you with everything you need to install Magic Quill successfully. Stick around for tips, troubleshooting advice, and workflow examples. Let's dive in and make magic happen. First things first, go to the GitHub installation page and scroll down to the Setup tab where the installation instructions are provided. Now copy the Git clone URL. Ensure you do not copy the CD command. Navigate to the Comfy UI Custom Nodes folder. Open the folder path where Comfy UI's custom nodes are located. Use the command prompt hand to open the terminal at this folder location. Now clone the repository. Paste the git clone URL into the command prompt and press enter. Once the installation is complete, close the command prompt. Another alternative method to download the Magic Quill Customs node is by using the Comfy UI Manager. To do so, Open the Comfy UI Manager and navigate to the Custom Nodes Manager. In the search box, type Magic Quill and click the Install button. Once installation completes, close the panel. Click Update All and restart Comfy UI. Next, download the models required to run Magic Quill. Locate the provided download link for the models and copy it. Ensure it's only the link without additional code. Now paste the copied link into your browser and press Enter. And as you can see, you will be prompted to save the model zip files into your computer. Note that the installation will take a long time due to the fact that we are downloading over 28 gigabyte of file, so be patient. Once the download is completed, extract the zip file and move the extracted contents into the appropriate folders under the models directory in Comfy UI. So make sure all the content is copied into the models folder. Folders like preprocessor, lava fine tune clean, in paint, they should go under the Models folder. Checkpoints content should be moved to the Checkpoints folder, which contains the SD version 1.5 folder. The ControlNet contents go under the ControlNet folder, and Configs contents go under the Configs folder. Before proceeding with the requirements environment dependencies, make sure you do this first. Follow these steps. Locate the Site Packages folder in Comfy UI. Mine is located here. Find yours in your Comfy UI directory. Now use the command prompt and to open the terminal at this folder location, execute the following commands. pip install albucor version 0.0.1.16. Wait for the installation to finish. pip install transformers version 4.37.2. Wait for the installation to finish. Close the command prompt. Now we can go ahead to install the requirements environment dependencies. Navigate to the Magic Quill custom nodes folder. Open command prompt in this folder location using command. Install the required dependencies by executing the following command. pip install minus r requirements.txt. Press enter and wait for the installation to complete. Once the installation is completed, we can now open the workflow. We've made this workflow available for download on Civit AI. To get it, visit civit.ai and search for AI Motion Studio, where you'll find our newly released Magic Quill Comfy UI workflow. Download it, open it on Comfy UI, or if you prefer, you can create the workflow manually. To create the workflow, just double click on an empty space and type Magic Quill. Then select the node to open NEN. Now to the left, double click again and type Load Checkpoints, then select the first node to open. Now connect the nodes by matching their colors, purple to purple, yellow to yellow, red to red. Now to the right, double click again and type save image, then select the first node to open. Connect image to image. That's all you are ready to use the workflow. Now let's try out Magic Quill on Comfy UI. First, let's upload an image we'd like to edit. For this image example, I want to change her outfit. So I'll mask the outfit area and enter the prompt, fancy golden dress. Then I'll hit the Q prompt to Farda. In just a few seconds, we have our result. But hmm, I'm not a fan of this dress. Let's rerun the generation.
and here we go. This one looks much better. I'll go ahead and accept the changes. Next, I want her to have longer hair. I'll mask the hair area and click Q prompt. Okay, this hair isn't quite what I had in mind. Let's add more to the mask to make the hair longer. Now, let's run it again. Wow, this looks amazing. I'll accept these changes. The longer hair really suits her. Now, let's have some fun with hair colors. Using the brush tool, I'll select pink, magenta, and blue, then hit Q prompt. I love this vibrant look. Next, let's change the background. I'll mask the entire background of the image. This part takes a little time, so I'll speed it up for you. Now I'll try a nightclub background prompt. Let's see how that looks. Not quite what I was aiming for. Let's adjust the prompt to runway fashion show background. There we go. This is much better. The scene really complements her look. Finally, let's add some sunglasses. I'll mask her eyes with two circular masks and a rectangular one between them to create a sunglasses shape. Then I'll hit Q prompt. And wow, that's perfect. As you can see, Magic Quill makes it easy to edit any image seamlessly in Comfy UI. If you found this tutorial helpful, don't forget to like this video and subscribe to the channel. If you have any questions, drop them in the comments below. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.